uh, experiencing today all over the world is much more complex and much more insidious. Jadi uh, sifat konflik yang terjadi saat ini sudah berubah dari konflik yang kita kenal zaman dulu. Jadi sekarang bukan lagi konflik antara dua pihak yang bertikai, tapi sekarang konfliknya sudah menjadi semakin kompleks dan rumit. The sheer number of uh, conflict venues today is much more than perhaps we have we have seen in history. So there are two things that we need to do. One is to be aware of the, 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 the different types of conflicts that are around us and the complex, uh, complexity of those. And the second is to also see peace in a, in a different way because peace previously used to be with the cessation of hostilities between two nations. So when two nations were at war, when the war stopped, that was known as, as, the, as the era of peace. But the times that we are living in, peace also needs to be conceptualized differently. Okay, jadi um, sekarang kita uh, perlu melihat ada dua hal, yaitu mengenai jenis-jenis uh, 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 konflik tipe uh, yang berbeda. Dan yang kedua adalah uh, bagaimana kita me melihat perdamaian dari konteks yang berbeda, karena kalau dulu perdamaian itu hanya hanya didefinisikan saat dua pihak yang bertikai sudah uh, tidak saling konflik.